Welcome to this module on API integration. In this video, we are going to check how to integrate an API into the Yellow AI platform. For our demonstration, we are going to use Open Weather Map, which is a public API. The Git call in this API works with the help of a key, which we can get by signing on to their website. A sample Git call is given here. Let us open it in a browser window. We replace the city name and API key that's assigned to us. All the API keys can be found by going to our profile and clicking on my API keys. Copy the API key and paste it in the URL. This will return an API response. What we see here are the weather details for the city that we have mentioned in our request. This is a sample weather API, which we are going to test on our platform. Let's see how to do that. Copy the URL. Let us go back to our platform. Click on Studio and then click on API. This is our place to integrate APIs. Click on Add New API. Let us give a unique name for the API. Choose the method of the API call. In our case, it is a Git call. Paste the URL in the text box. Click on Add New API again. Now we see that we have an API client ready and integrated into the platform, which is going to help us test the API with all the necessary configurations. The Git call is mentioned here in the URL, all we have to do is hit the send button. This will return the API response if successful, along with the status code. We can see the entire body of the JSON response. In the Git API call, we don't have any other configurations to be done. Parameters that are supposed to be passed in the URL can be found in the params section. We can always change these values. We can have these API calls configured for different environments in your platform. We can use different API keys for different environments. We can also import APIs using the import export functionality. If we click on import, we can import the API as either a curl command or postman collection or a JSON format. Just give the API name, and the API will appear on the integration section in the same way. Typically, for our bot journeys, we will want to use parameters to pass dynamic values. Parameters can be easily incorporated in your URL by using a mustache expression. We can do the same for your app IDs to pass the API key. On hitting the send button, we will be asked to enter the values. Do remember to save the API on making any changes. If required, refresh the page to see the changes getting reflected. This is how we can test our APIs in the platform. In the next section, we will see how to integrate this API in our bot journeys. Thanks for watching.